Hello everybody and welcome back to uh, XCOM Enemy Within where I am on uh, I think this is the first mission of the month of uh, let's see March April so it's of uh, May then yeah yeah it's only the third month so but usually the beginning of the month has new enemies but this being a UFO landing mission I'm not sure if we'll see one or not we're at two rookies, pretty risky, but uh, let's, uh, I don't know where any meld is, and I don't know where the UFO is, so I guess I'll just kind of run forward here, uh, this direction, or I guess I could go toward this ramp maybe. Got any, oh wait, there's a meld rotating right there, so never mind. Decision made. Okay. Well, let's see if Michaela triggers anything if she goes this far. Nope, okay. Alright, sorry about that. I was, uh, I got a phone call there. Okay, so Michaela didn't see anything up there and I moved her first. Okay. Time to move some other people. I right, guess I will just move toward that meld without on using dashes unless of course I encounter something seekers okay now do they stay there or do they move I bet they move because they get to me really quick on their turn so now I'm going to remember to use Jake's battle scanner so let's see about right there Boom! Hello, Seekers! Now the only advantage you got is that you can fly. Okay, so. Let's get everybody up and shooting at those things. The bad thing here is, uh, if I miss them, they'll definitely come in for a strangle. But, cover doesn't matter here, so let's just get everybody up in there. Get as high percentage shots as we can. When they're flying like that, it's hard. Now, see, the good thing about the Overwatch is it's a definite. Well, when they get so close, it makes it like a definite hit. Okay. Jake will probably take anything out I shoot with him, so. Well, it's only 70%. Them being flyers makes them really good. Alright, well, let's go with you first. Adjusting aim. Okay, let's go with one of the rookies next. Must be a kill. Beautiful. Looks like we can't see the other one entirely. Let's see if you can get it. A miss. Uh, can Jake see it? Jake, Jake, damn it. Maybe it considers me already using his turn with the scanner. If that's the case, that kind of sucks. Let's move up here with her and see if she gets a shot. Sorry about that, I had to move the mic. Uh, she doesn't see it. Alright, overwatch that. Cover doesn't matter. Same. We should still be okay. Okay, so Jake using the scanner. Oh, well, that confirms they can shoot. Uh, I know it's there, I see it. I love it when it is that. Or maybe I don't love it. Okay, so it didn't move there. Can anybody see it? Well, no, but we can get closer. And who got the kill? I believe it was... Rice here, one with a good aim. Um, That's affirmative. I don't want to wake up anybody else, so let's be careful about this. I'd like for the lower ranked people to get the kills. I need to be a little more careful about the routes I take. No. You don't see it. 
What? Oh, it lowered down to the ground. I guess that tree truck must be in his way. Wow, my bad. Okay, well. Heading to that location. Somebody's got to kill this thing, Michaela. Let's go, old faithful. Okay, well, down to one. Uh, let's see, I'd rather my sniper get a... I'm on it, Commander. My uh, snapshot sniper get a, get a shot at this. Let's see if your laser pistol is any... Oh yeah, you get more. More of a chance here. Wow, 79% from this. I've seen worse. It's okay. Uh, yeah, let's move up there. See if you can get another kill. You'll be the hero. Oh, you can't see it. Well, Overwatch. Overwatch with you, I think. Uh, shit. I did not mean to do that. Wow. That was a bad misclick. Okay, someone kill this thing. Oh. Anybody else on Overwatch? Yep. Come on, Rook. There we go. Both my rookies have a kill. Where's that noise coming from? It usually says. Well, we're gonna head toward that melt now. Uh. Okay, so we need to move careful now that we're not looking at seekers anymore. And there's the UFO. So maybe the other melds around there, but it looks like there's... Oh, it doesn't go too much farther that way, but the meld could be over there. I'm sure it'll tell me where it is after a, a little bit. Um... Headed there now. We're over here with Michaela and reload. Reloaded. I guess I should wait to make those decisions until... just to make sure nobody else reveals anything. Let's, uh, get... Actually, you need to reload, too. Just to be safe, and two more shots, he's gonna be done. Okay, so... I'd rather dash with Jake here, so, uh... Where are you? There you go. Yeah, let's get Jake as far as I can since I messed up with him last turn. Might be a good idea to have Jake go get that because that way he'll have the kind of the peak of this map. Which is good for a sniper. Uh, and I should probably have three approach it from this side, three from this side. That seems fun. So I can have one sniper go this way. I guess I'll have the other rookie come this way with on it, Commander. Michaela and the uh, sniper. Let's rock. Really, Jake and Michaela are the only decently promoted people on this mission. I can go up there and get that, but I might reveal some aliens, so let's just reload. Jeez. And I haven't moved with her yet, so... Let's see if that reveals to anybody. Okay, good. Uh, I don't want to move over there. She's got snapshot, so switch to your sniper and Overwatch. Okay. And here comes a pack of thin men. Come on, take one down. Come on, do it for me. All right. One down. A rocket will end this. And the other meld is probably in the UFO. Or on the opposite side of it. Uh, but priorities. We gotta take down those thin men. And it looks like Jake doesn't have a shot either way, so let's go ahead and get the meld with him. Well, we can use his pistol at least. Let's see. You see them. Very good. You get a grenade that far. Maybe if you run up, can you get a rocket that far? Oh yes. So if all else fails, the rocket will take them out. Okay, I'd like to get this sniper promoted, so... 
The rookies already have kills, but more importantly, I need to... Actually, let me just do one with the sniper here. Five damage. Let's headshot just to be sure if she hits that she kills it. Or not. Okay, so, uh, Rook, you're the good rookie. Let's get you down hey there. there and hopefully get a good shot on one. Let's pistol and go for the weaker. Miss. Okay, looking like that... Uh, looking like that rocket is going to be what we go with. Let's see, how about you? Stand up here in a pretty good spot. But apparently you don't see them. Uh, okay. Let's go with you. I don't see anything from here. Nope. Does Jake see anything? Yes, but he's gonna have to... Gonna have to bust out his pistol. Let's see, five damage. Oh, you gotta use a sniper for the squad site there, so let's go for this one. Okay. There's one alive with one hit point. I feel like it's a huge waste to, uh... So he can poison a whole group here if I do that. Huge waste to use a rocket for one hit point on one guy. Uh, let's just go for this. It's 56%. Oh. Thank you. Alright. I guess when you got six people, it's just likely... Oh yeah, she can still shoot or move. Oh, I didn't even consider that. That should have made it a very easy decision. Uh, let's I'm go over here with you. Could have overwatched, I guess. Okay, I'm gonna have this guy kind of tail along with Jake, and also this rookie. Since none of you could even see them for some reason, they must have been perfectly behind those logs. Another group of thin men. Well, I really should have. Uh, Someone on Overwatch, I guess, but I don't know if it'd have mattered. Okay, time to bring out the sniper. And he's got one in his sights, so that's probably a guaranteed kill. Let's get the rookies in on some action. Of course, a rocket here would. Uh, well, I don't want to destroy that power supply. Actually, no. I'm definitely going with this. Actually,. I'm gonna go with the shredder rocket. That way other people have increased damage. But mainly the reason I'm doing this is to blow open some cover for everybody else. And I don't want to hit the power supply, so let's go with that please. Going hot. And I got two of them anyway. <laughs> Very nice. Surprised I didn't wake up the outsider. He's gotta be in there somewhere. You see that other meld? No. Okay. Uh, does anybody see the other thin man? No, nobody does. I'm on How about we get you up there? We see him. Alright, this guy's gonna be really good. He's got really good aim, so he doesn't need to be an assault, but I would like another assault. Maybe I should have made a mech out of uh, a support since I've got a decent amount of those. <laughs> oh well, too late to change my mind. Let's, uh. Hmm. What else is in there? Let's get you in a decent sniping position. Although, I'd rather you come out here and reload, I guess. Because if the outsider's in there and I go over there, she's probably going to be wide open for like, getting killed the Not next turn. Alright, I guess let's uh, start the approach from this direction. We 
I got full cover right there. Hopefully that didn't wake anybody up. Very nice. Overwatch then. You. Uh, you can't make it to anywhere good in one turn. I'm afraid if I go there, it'll definitely be someone to see him. Where can Jake make it to? Up here, back here. That's probably a good spot for Jake. Way back here behind the full cover. We'll have this guy run down behind this rock. And you just switch to your pistol and overwatch then. I think that's everybody. I hope it's not about to blow. I'd like to get both. Okay, looks like we're good to move here. So if all that's left is the outsider, which I don't know if that's the case. But I wonder if I run in one way, if he'll run out the other. I'd let, I guess these guys need some kills, so I'm going to rush it from this side, see if, see if the aliens that are in there run toward Jake and his team. Okay, so, let's put you right there, see if you trigger anything. There we go. There it is. So he's either gonna... Okay, he kinda ran. That looks like the primary power ah, source man, if I shoot at him, I'll probably take out... If he misses, he might take out that power supply. I'd watch your fire down there. That equipment could be highly unstable. Yeah, if I can take that while it's still good then uh, I get more money. Plus I need to research them and use them for my own ships. Uh, let's get her up here and see if she sees him. 46%. Do you see him? No. I need to get her in a better spot though. Let's go for that full cover. Uh, I guess I will go for some shots here. But let's see if Jake's crew can make it down into a decent spot. Jake, of course, should be able to sit somewhere in here and have a good look at him. I'm going to move him last just because I'm, he's not going to have a shot anyway, either way. Let's oh, see, yeah, the rookie yeah, can come on this side. 35%. Wow, there's going to be a lot of uh, Running. probable misses and also probable hitting the power supply, but let's go with you first because I'd rather you get the kill. Missed, okay. I hope that wasn't my computer or something. Alright, Jake, let's get you down here. Yeah, he sees it now. Okay, then I'd rather... Well, you can't shoot, so... Actually, I guess... Let's try to get somebody to major. Actually, if she misses, it's going to be all over the place. Let's go for you, man. Okay, okay. Um... Let's, let's try it. Just don't take out that power supply, for God's sake! Don't take it out. Whew, very nice. Another one down. Good work, Commander. Oh wow, that was nice. Okay, perfect mission. Let's go back. Didn't take out the power supply. That's what I'm most proud of. Also, I need to build arc throwers. I could have captured. Probably about it. Well, I don't think you capture the mechanical things like seekers, but I could have got a thin man there. I think. Could have got an outsider. Excellent work, oh, well. Commander. I'm impressed you were able to recover Two so supports. much of the substance without any casualties. I almost wish I could change my mind on the on the mech. All right, very nice. And make it a support because I'm not getting any assaults. How much longer I got to go on that? One day. How much does another one cost, actually? So, where are my supports? Got James Rice and Jorge Alvarez. I don't want to make them because they're already promoted pretty well, although I don't think that matters. 
If I was to put him in there, cost 10 and 10. Nearby allies and cover receive plus 10 defense. So the other one gets like a lot of defense for himself, and this one gets that. Can I pull the other guy out? No. Okay, well, I made my decision. I don't want to go with another one yet then. Because uh, I want to save my meld for other things, possibly. Alright, let's go to the situation room. Sell our da oh, wow, we didn't have any damage stuff. That's nice. Okay. How much to build a uh, gene lab? Fifty dollars. And I'm running out of power. Oh wait, I need arc throwers. Arc throwers. Gotta remember. Okay, twenty-one. Uh. I'm going to go with one for now because I don't know if I need two yet. And they're made instantly, so... Uh, I guess I will go with a gene lab. Actually, let me wait until my guy's done before I build that because I don't know if I'm going to have to spend all my meld on him or not. Uh, let's move on. Got an achievement. He's done. Well, he's been made into a freak, but... I assume he's going to be a badass when he becomes a high rank colonel. Interfaces are holding stable, but they're of no use without a cyber suit to interface with. This reminds me of uh, Deus Ex: Human Revolution. This guy's like, I never I asked for this. Manufacture one immediately. When our new mech trooper equips that suit, I think you. And he's never going to get laid properly again. I mean, I didn't realize what I was doing to him. But hey, it's gonna be awesome. Maybe he doesn't have the urge to have sex anymore, and it doesn't matter. He gets his sexual thrill from killing aliens from now on. I, I guess that'll be the good thing. Uh, let's see, go to mech inventory. Mechs are powerful armored suits with the extra tactical abilities. Only mech troopers, soldiers augmented in the cybernetic lab, may equip mechs in battle. The mech has three tech levels. Research is required to gain access to mech upgrades. Okay. Build new mech. I got plenty for that. 170. So we can go with either a flamethrower, allows the mech to lay waste to a cone shaped area. Powerful arm upgrade for the mech, allowing the wielder to pulverize ancient adjacent cover in enemies. Also boosts mobility. I think I like this one more because it seems like I'm only lucky when they group up, and I've got plenty of rockets right now for that, and grenades. And this, I'd like him to be more mobile, and uh, if he can do a ton of damage up close, that's fine by me. Yep. Success, mech online. The new mech is ready for deployment. Go to the barracks and select a mech trooper to equip this mech for battle. Build cost 25. Cannot upgrade, missing research. Alright, well I guess it requires further research to upgrade that. Uh, go to the barracks and... Uh, So do we put this guy in there? Throw. Collateral damage. Area of effect attack that destroys most cover and hits all eligible targets for 34% damage. This cannot attack. This attack cannot cause critical hits. Okay. So uh, yeah, destroy a bunch of cover. That'll be good for my snipers. Shots from Overwatch no longer suffer any aim penalty. Alright. Confers plus 15 defense when in Overwatch. Uh, his aim is rather bad, so I'm gonna go with advanced fire control. Hopefully he eventually gets enough hit points where defense isn't too big of a concern. Uh, let's see. Plus he's got this, so he's he'll, he'll probably be fine. Although I'm kind of thinking I... Let's see. Let's customize your head. Are they always just wearing this helmet now? Oh, wait, here we go. I was toggling the wrong one. <laughs> I 
It looks ridiculous with a regular head. Wow. Uh, probably give him a helmet because this looks ridiculous. <laughs> nice. You see this guy walking on the street with a fedora. That looks pretty cool. Uh, that would look pretty awesome also. Eh, his original helmet's actually not so bad. So we'll go with that. So we just give you this. Oh, nice. Yeah, he does look pretty awesome. Can provide a decisive advantage in close quarters and remove the benefits of cover from our enemies. All right, just got his mini gun. Okay, that's all we can do there. So I'm gonna assume I can color him. Let's see, we got deco one, two, nice, three. It's kind of a camera look. Four. One. Okay, I liked two, so let's look at the different colors. The bumblebee. That one's good. Oh, nice. That one's pretty cool, too. Let's see. <laughs> Some of these bright ones. I might go with a bright one. Uh, let's see. Just because it's kind of my style, I guess. We're back to the standard. One, two. I think I might go back to that blue. Well, that black and white is pretty cool. Although I like this black and yellow too. Yeah, he's gonna be black and yellow. Okay, so uh, yeah, his will went pretty high up there. His aim just needs to improve, but he's only a corporal, so it'll get there. Okay. Oh well, everybody's coming out too. Sarah Lingerman's the only one left in there. I've got way too many supports so I really wish they'd have become assaults that really sucks but I mean I should have made a support out of with the mech but oh well that way I'd have an assault but uh... we've assembled everything we need to capture and house an alien for interrogation oh, yeah. commander yeah that's fine the rest is up to our forces on the ground okay so let me build a gene lab to see what I can do with that which means I need more money. So let's see. I don't feel like I need Thin Man. I don't really know what they build, but I want to keep floaters and sectoids for the uh, interceptors. So uh, let's let's get 50 bucks somehow out of this. So there's 30. Let's see. What do I? I don't feel like I need Seekers. Although I I don't know what they're used for either. Uh, I hope they're not used for anything important because I'm going to sell some. Uh, I think I only need like 55. Actually, more like 50, uh, 42, but uh, actually, that should be good then. Things are relatively quiet for the moment. Guess we should enjoy it while it lasts. Sure. Satellite uplink about to finish, which I'm not going to launch that until the end of the month. This is probably going to bring me to the limit of my power. So, let's see. I'm going to build some labs like this. So let's get the gene lab right here. Okay, ten days for that. And that counts as a workshop. Very nice. So I'll probably come down here pretty soon and put in a thermo generator whenever I need more power. I need two power just for the lift, so I need to be careful about that. So I need to pretend but like I've only got three power to play with. Which might not be enough to do anything anyway. How much for another laboratory? Three power. So the only thing limiting me is uh, my money right now. Okay, so I'm going to wait because I don't want to pay the maintenance if I don't have to. So let's go back. Uh, yeah, I've already got an arc thrower. Someone's gonna have to take it. Start capturing aliens. The other good thing about capturing aliens is you can get their guns intact. I got ten dollars for that. Let's carry on. Uh, yes. Okay, we got abductions. I'm going to Asia. Asia, if I can. 
Abductions in progress are marked on the hollow. Okay, I'm gonna avoid France because I think I'm going to launch. Uh, get a lieutenant sniper here. Okay, engineers and money. That's fine. I'd rather have an assault, but I'm pretty sure I've got to go to India here. Although I could just keep going to Europe and, uh, nah. The reason I say that is, uh, all these countries could panic and I could just launch all my satellites over their countries. It's only the 6th of May, so I think if I start a, uh, yeah, it takes like 14 days to build a satellite uplink, so as long as I start one by, uh, the 16th, although that's cutting it really close, so I should probably make it more like the 14th. I'm just gonna go here though. Either way, I don't wanna go to Egypt and I'd rather have the money. So let's go here. To go for a sniper I don't really want. Well, I don't feel like I need. Although it is a lieutenant sniper, which means I could make it a nice uh, s snap shooter right off the bat. Because McGregor's only a corporal. Okay, so. Let's just make sure we're bringing our good people for this one. Maybe... I'm gonna bring one rookie because, for the love of God, I need another assault. Rookie Ryan. She looks kinda like Charity by default. Yeah. Yeah, I need a, I need an assault so badly that uh, I might want to start bringing in more people. Actually, uh... Officer training. We got new guy. Okay, we need a major for this. Okay. Soldier. So, uh, what I could do is once I get this new guy, just start hiring new people until I get like two assaults. <laughs> That'd be nice. So, we got lead by example, rapid recovery. Okay. We don't really need rapid recovery right now because I think we've only got. No, yeah, we've only got one person there for one day, so. We could use it, but I'm not gonna blow the money on it right now when I've got other problems. So let's go. We're getting a new sniper anyway. Yeah, India please. Let's go. Uh, I think the way it works is who you put in the middle, or actually I think the leader is always the highest rank by default, so Jake's going, Kayla's going, we got Charity going. Um, we're gonna have our mech go. There you are. He's only a corporal, so he might miss a lot. We need to get him some kills. Uh, definitely the, the rookie here. And who else? I guess I'd rather have someone higher ranked. And this sniper is not so necessary anymore because I'm gonna get a lieutenant and I'm probably gonna make her the snap shooter. Although Charlotte's pretty good aim. Um, but let's go with two heavies instead of two snipers. Yeah, that way I've got two heavies getting rather well promoted. So. Uh, I need to make items available. I just got reminded of the arc thrower. Um, the heavies are probably not going to be getting up into the action. I mean, maybe they will. I don't know. And his aim is decent. I've only got one arc thrower, and I'd have to sell stuff to make another. Uh, the rookie is definitely not getting an arc thrower. Although, actually, maybe that wouldn't be so bad. Her aim is... Her will and aim are down a little bit from average, but her aim's about average. So she could panic. I don't want her getting up in there. Oh, wait, not like that. So let's scope her. And laser pistol and laser rifle. Also, we need to get you in your stormtrooper outfit. There we go, 28. Okay. Let's see what you can bring, or do I already have you? Yeah, I've already got what you can bring. 
Very nice. All right, more. Let's look at this loadout. A couple frags. Hmm. Maybe I'll give her the art thrower. I don't want it to go to charity because she needs to bring the med kits. Jake's never going to be up and close in the action. Although his aim is so damn good. 96 plus 10. Uh, I'm going to let him get up to major because he'll probably go over 100 then and then I'll start giving him the, the respirator. And you, well... Actually, I'm going to give you the... Uh, I'm going to give him the art thrower, just in case. I don't feel like he really needs the... because his hollow targeting is pretty good, so he doesn't really need the aim. Um, because it makes everybody else better. Yeah. I keep forgetting, I'm trying to get him to this. There we go. Okay, so here we go. Um, yeah, we're, she's got the double grenades, so I like that. Scope for the rookie. Let's go for Jake. Um, you. Laser rifle and laser pistol, please. And Jake's already got laser pistol. We can't carry pistols. Okay, we're all good. I definitely had a, a chance to capture that outsider in the last mission, too. Dropship has arrived. Uh, yeah, let's begin the assault then. The area of engagement if for I'd this mission would be in India. Is. We're still picking up transmissions indicating alien movement in one of their major city centers. We should get down there. Okay, let's reduce panic in Asia for once. That's our big mech. Nice. This is Big Sky. Strike team has reached the AO. Requesting authorization to deploy. Solid copy, Big Sky. Strike one is clear to engage. Okay. Oh, this map. I've played this map before. And if I remember right, I had a bad experience on it. But I've got some more experience now because of it, so we're good. Alright, I don't see any meld containers, and I also need to end this part, so... Thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.